A car is traveling down the highway at speed B when the driver slams on the brakes and skids to a stop in a distance D. Assuming the same frictional force, how far would the car slide if its speed was 2V? You may pause the video now and attempt an answer of your own. If the car is skidding to a stop, it means that its final velocity is equal to zero. Therefore, in your model for constant acceleration, we have final velocity squared is equal to initial velocity squared plus two times acceleration times displacement, where your final velocity is zero. This means that your acceleration is given by the expression negative v squared over 2d. If this is the acceleration and we assume it to be constant by starting with twice the velocity, then we should have that the final velocity squared should be equal to 2v squared plus 2 times negative v squared over 2d times d prime. Taking the final velocity as zero, we have negative 4v squared is equal to negative v squared over d times d prime. Of course, the square of the speed cancels out, the negatives cancel out, and what we have is 4d is equal to d prime. In other words, if you have doubled the velocity, then the distance for stopping is multiplied times 4. And that is option E. Thank you for watching. See you next time.